2019, I have to give up my protest. I have no intention of giving up my protest. My plans are just to continue with my protest and to um, to try and uh, quicken the recount as as much as possible. Uh, we have all I have always been uh, saying, uh, and I continue to say that two years is a very long time to to keep the Filipino people waiting as to what is the real story, what really happened during the last elections. Uh, I think it's well accepted that there was cheating. Papanong ginawa exactly how 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 many votes? What were the real results? Hindi hindi karapat dapat na pinag-aantay ng dalawang taon ng taong bayan bago sabihin, ito yung naging problema, ito yung nangyari, kaya kayo nagsususpecha ng dayan dahil ito yung nakita ninyo, ito yung nangyari. Ito ang tunay na bilang. Yan ang inaasahan namin. That's, that's all I'm really working at this, uh, these days. It's natural for a protestant to find that it's to take, taking too long. Uh, at saka parang ang pakiramdam ko, siyempre, panayang delay, panayang delay. Uh, pero at least nandito na tayo sa recount. My sister, Gob Aimi, is uh, planning to, is, is, is thinking about running for the Senate. Uh, sa ngayon, eh, medyo may ikot-ikot na siya para tignan kung ano ba talaga, kung uh, maganda ang kanyang, ang kanyang uh, chances sa, 2000, uh, uh, sa 2019 elections for the Senate. Uh, yung mother ko nag uh, mag-graduate din kasi she's congresswoman sa 2nd district. I'm not sure kung ano yung iniisip niyang gawin. Uh, tapos yung uh, mga yung mga bata, yung mga the the the, the sons of Amy and uh, sa so, yung mga anak namin ni Amy ni Irene at saka ako, eh, baka yung iba may, may balak pumasok sa politika. Pero yan, ganyan pa. Hindi, sila magdi, hindi pa sila nagde-decide. Sinasabi ko nga sa kanila, malapit na. At ang deadline is October. An endorsement from a very popular president, like President Digong, eh, malaking bagay yun sa national. Eh, matindi ang suporta ni President, president Duterte. So, syempre, pag in-endorse siya, eh, marami sa... Marami sa supporter niya ay sasang ayon at uh, na susunda ng kanyang payo. Parang built-in yung suporta mo eh. Kasi halimbawa, sabihin ni Presidente, tulungan nyo itong taong ito, magaling ito, gawin nating senador ito. Ah, hindi na bali si Amy, let's say anybody. May percentage ka agad ng supporter niya, nasa, nasa kanya na, na, napupunta na doon sa kandidatong yun. So of course, it's a big advantage. At uh, kung makuha mo yung bilang kandidato, siyempre magpapalakasin ang loob mo noon pag, na, pag naramdaman mo yun. I'm sure that uh, I'm is uh, feeling, the, feeling the same way. Uh, that it's a very important endorsement, uh, and the endorsement of the president. Perhaps the most important endorsement, especially now, dahil ang taas ng approval rating ni Digong. Uh, the president has a very high approval rating. And yung kanyang approval rating, yung mga kanyang supporter, hindi yung soft, yung talagang diehard. Pero diehard, pero majority, 80 plus percent. Matindi yun. Matagal na tayo hindi nakakita ng ganun. So... It is, it is certainly, it, it must be uppermost in, in the minds of not only Gob, Gob Aimi as a potential candidate, but all the candidates for national positions, especially even for local. Sandra right now is still, uh, is still at work. May nagtatrabaho siya sa, sa UK. Uh, hindi pa niya matatapos yung plot, but he will be finished before, uh, uh, before next year. So, makakapag-decide na siya na hindi niya iniisip yung kanyang trabaho. So, we'll, we'll, uh, uh, we'll be talking to him at length uh, over the next few months na kung ano ba talagang plano niya. But uh, he, he, he's definitely been, he, he's very interested in the whole process. No? Kasi ang nangyari talaga dyan ay nataon nung eleksyon, ng, na, na, nung kampanya ng, 2000 and, ng 2016, Nagbakasyon sila, nagbabakasyon sila dito at uh, different times. So sinasama ko sila. Uh, kundi hindi ko na sila makikita eh. eh nung nakita naging ano, naging active si Sandro. Actually, silang tatlong yung anak ko naging naging active. At nakita niya pa, ganito pala ito. Uh, medyo na iba, hindi namin akalain na ganito pala ang kampanya, na ganito yung mga pinag-iisipan, ganito yung mga uh, mga traba yung trabaho sa kampanya. So uh, ganun na lang uh, ganun na lang iniwan ko na lang doon so if anyone wants to pick it up and anyone wants to go and, and, and be, be a candidate well syempre syempre nandito kami tutulak namin Ay, siguro kahit anong whatever words you have kahit na anong salita ang aking gamitin sa pasasalamat eh, sa, sa aking palagay hindi sapat pero 
paulit-ulit ko sinasabi na uh, malalim ang aming pasasalamat sa ating mga supporter. At nandyan sila lagi sa hirap at uh, sa ginhawa. At uh, lagi naman silang nandyan at uh, very very sincere ang kanilang support. Kaya uh, ano pang magagawa namin kundi magpasalamat uh, na paulit-ulit. Kahit araw-araw ay -araw, eh, pampapasalamat kami sa inyo sa tuluyan ninyong pag, uh, pagsuporta, sa tuluyan ninyong pagmamahal uh, sa amin at uh, sa tuluyan ninyong pa panindigan.